Hey guys, I'm Mike from On Point Craps. In today's video, we're gonna look at some more hybrid play, but this time we're keeping the probability of winning in our favor. Hey guys, welcome back to the On Point Craps table. Today's video is some more hybrid play. Uh, the difference is here, we're not gonna go over one strategy, I'm gonna to touch on a couple different strategies, but with each of them, we keep the probability of winning in our favor. Uh, it works great with some basic strategies like the uh, Iron Cross or the six, seven, eight, uh, can't lose type strategies. Uh, as always, there's no guarantee that any strategy will win, but what this does is keep you strong um, against the seven and tends to bring back Money into your rack with nearly every roll. Um, we're going to start with a $500 bankroll, trying to keep it again at a moderate level where uh, your average Joe can play. Uh, the risk here, being a hybrid strategy, we're going to start with that don't pass uh, bet. We're going to start with a $100 don't pass. Now, like I said, big risk there. It's a fifth of our bankroll. If we get whacked here a couple times, uh, it could end us for end our night early before we really even get started. If we can beat this come out roll and start placing some bets, we're guaranteed uh, to bring back money into the rack nearly every roll. So let's see what we're going to do here. Let's try to get a point here. Looking for any point. Place her out. And we get a four. That is a hard four. The ballerina 2-2. Two, two. So the point is four. Now when we get a four like that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna bet the inside numbers. And what that's gonna look like is 66 inside. That's $15 on each of the five and nine and $18 on the six and eight. So at this point, you look at the numbers we have covered we have six ways to hit the seven. And then we have, what, 10, uh, 18 ways. So that's a 24 ways, am I, I think, 24 ways to, to possibly win here. Um, because what will happen, if we hit any of these point numbers, we we take in uh, money to our rack. The only number that can really hurt us right here is the four. The four has three ways to win. I'm sorry, well, three ways to win, but would lose because we're on a don't pass. So it has three ways to be hit, which leaves 33 other potential combinations of dice uh, to be rolled. We win on any of the inside numbers, and if we do happen to roll big red, which inevitably happens, We'll win 100 here, we'll lose 66, and we will net $34. So with every hit of the dice, other than this number right here, we're bringing back our cash. So let's roll it out and see what happens. Dice are out. And right off the bat, 0.7 out. That is a 347. So you'll see all this goes away. We lose it. But we're going to bring $100 here on the don't pass. And as I said, we lost 66, but we won 100 for a total of a $34 net gain. So just like that, we're already in the positive. So we're at a new shooter here. We're going to go right back with this $100 don't pass. Let's see if we can get another point established. Dice are out. And that's a six. It's a four, two, six that rolled on me. Four, two, six, it's a lumber, two by four. So the point is six. You roll a six like this, we can go into an iron cross strategy. Uh, we're probably gonna need some, uh, cash in some of these greens. So we'll do that right now. We'll get 25 in red. 
and we are going to put 25 on the 5, 18 on the 8, and 18 in the field. Now at this point, 6 will give us 5 ways to possibly lose on the 7. We have every other number covered. Every number on this table will win us money except for that six. So 31 possible combinations to win us money no matter what happens. Let's roll it out and see what happens. Place her out. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Well, this is what happens. Um, back to back two by fours. So that is the point. We are going to lose this don't pass. So easy come, easy go. Uh, we lose here in the field. So that was a $115 loss. So we have a couple different choices at this point. We can keep this out here and let it roll out, or we can start from scratch. We are going to start from scratch. We're not that off. We're down a little bit. Remember, we had 130 or 34. Uh, so we're down about $75 maybe. But we can fight back, no problem. Again, we're on the don't pass. New set of dice. And dice are out. And there's an eight, five, three, eight. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Five, three, eight. Again, we're gonna go right back to that iron cross. 18 on the six. 25 on the 5, 15 in the field. So let's show how this works this time. Dice are out. That's big red. That's a point seven out. Not really showing the strength of these uh, strategies, but here you can see we're going to lose 15, 30, 55, we lose $58, but we win 100 So again, that's another net positive. Now remember, we started with $500. We're at $465, so we're not down that much. We've already been through th three shooters. And we're only down a little bit of money. Let's see if we can get this thing rolling. This is not the best uh, example of how these strategies work, but as I said, the dice tell the story. Don't pass, $100, dice are out. There's a 10, hard 10. Puppy paws. So again, as we said, when we get the four and 10, we're gonna work these inside numbers. So we know that that is 50, it's a 66 inside, we're gonna give the dealer 75. We'll get nine dollars in change. Let's try to win some money now. Again, only three ways to lose. Everything else should net us some money. We're hoping to hit some box numbers. Place her out. There's a nine. That's a neater nine. Five, four, nine. 15 on the nine pays us $21. There's a couple different things we can do here. I always like to bring something back to my rack. So what I'm going to do is just press this five and nine by five. I'm going to rack $11. So there you go, $11 to my rack. That just makes this seven stronger now, right? I originally had 66 out there with only 134. But I just won another you know, six dollars. I could have taken that. Um, sorry, twelve dollars, right? I think I paid myself wrong, but that's all right. We'll figure it out. Um, I'm just going to do a press, half press, just to uh, bring it up again. Every every hit of the box numbers makes this seven stronger because the money that's out there is not money we started with. Dice are out. And there's a six. 18 on the six, we'll pay 21. 
He got that 21 last time. We'll take that extra out. We we'll use that $12 to now press up the six and the eight. Brought $10 back to our rack. Place her out. 10. Mm. So that hurts a little bit. We're gonna lose this 100. But at this point, we're in the hand. What do we have out here? Always good to know, 20, 40, 60, 80, $88, not quite the 100, but we can recoup this very quickly. We're gonna wait for a come out, place her out. Four, hard four, that's my ballerina, two, two. And we're just gonna work these box numbers. Place her out. Two, one, three, three craps. Doesn't help us, doesn't hurt us. That's a Neener nine, five, four, nine. 21, that nine will pay us 28. We're gonna go ahead and rack that because we're behind. We can get a couple hits in there, we can get that, that back. Place her out. There's a six, five, one, six. Sorry, if they're rolling past the camera, we can't see, but it was a five, one, six. Again, 24 will go ahead and pay us uh, 28. Trying to make that 100 back. Takes her out. Snipe in the point, 314. Place her out. It's a nine. The point is nine. We're not playing the don't pass right now, so we're just going to go ahead and play these box numbers. Place her out. 415. It's another 28. We're going to take one more hit, and I'll show you what we'll do here. Place her out. Three, one, four, little Joe from Kokomo. Place her out. And that is a five, one, six. Five, one, six, six, easy. Again, that's gonna pay us 28. At this point, we've recouped that don't pass. What I'm gonna do here is now regress us down everything that we pressed and we're in this hand for free now everything here is profit place her out meaner nine that's the point five four nine we have sniped the nines that 15 is going to pay us 21 i'm going to drop And do a full press here. We are off. We're following the puck. Dice are out. Three, one, four. The point will be four. So this looks a lot like the skill 66 right now at this point. Dice are out. 12 midnight. All the dots and all the spots. Place her out. Neener nine. 20 pays 28. And I'm gonna go here. Go ahead and press them all up by one unit. So we're gonna make these look like 25 and 30. And we're happy here. We're just going to play this out. Place her out. Five. That pays 35. And we're just going to collect. We're at a point that I like here. Place her out. Eight. It's another 35. Put 
place her out. Two, one, three, three craps. Place her out. Four, one, five, that's another 35. Place her out. Another five, this time a three, two, five. Dice are working with us tonight. Place her out. And there's big red, three, four, seven. So I didn't quite get to show what I wanted to show tonight a little bit, uh, but we got our, the points, we got sniped out some. I'll show some more of that tomorrow um, or later this week. Uh, I'll run through uh, this again. I just want to keep this video short. Um, but let's see what we ended up with. Remember, our starting bankroll is 500. So let's go ahead and color these up. That's $75 right there. $100, $200. That's $300. 400, 500, we made 75, almost $85. Uh, this can, these whites, and said so these are tips, these are drink chips. I really don't want to count this in the profit. So $75 win. Said this style of play, it's not going to win you a lot of money, but it will bring money back to your rack. We got fortunate there uh, with the long roll and those inside numbers. Um, I'd like to show you some more of the hybrid play. So as I said, we'll revisit this again um, in my next video and take a look at uh, the same style of play and hopefully uh, give you a little bit better demonstration. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked what you saw. If you did, please smash that like button. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Um, hit that notification bell so you'll know when I put this follow-up video out. And last but not least, share this video uh, with your friends, family, anybody else you think might be interested so they can learn the game of craps, learn to love the game the way I do, and eventually I'll see you on the casino floor.